Hello, today I'm going to show you task constraint in Microsoft Project for the web. For this purpose, I created three tasks and a simple schedule, as you can see. If you hover your mouse uh, on start date, you will see exact start date. It is 4th of October and it will be started at 9 a.m. and it will be finished on 5th October or 5 p.m. Let's say, for some purpose, that this ta task should not start at 6th of October, but at 7th of October. Look at this icon, calendar icon, here, okay? I will click it here, and I will say it should start at 7th of October. Those dates uh, were changed, but you can see that also this icon was changed. So if I uh, if I uh, look at this icon, I can and I click on it, I will see that this task has constrained task no, uh, start not earlier, and it was set by me. So that is why I have this kind of icon here. I can remove that constraint if I want, and everything will, everything will be uh, 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 reversed back. But for now, let's say I want a seventh. What does it mean? It means that if my task will have one day duration, then this task still will start at 7th of October. Why? Because it cannot start earlier, even if uh, its pre predecessor was uh, uh, so was supposed to finish earlier. Okay, but if I put 10 days, for example, then this start date will be moved, okay, forward, and the constraint will be removed. Why? Because the constraint doesn't make a sense anymore, since constraint was set to 7th of October, and my, now, according to my schedule, uh, uh, if I put here 10 days and hit enter, it will go, uh, it will move task two forward. And since, uh, uh, because of that, 7th of October will be changed to 18th of October. And this constraint is, uh, doesn't exist anymore because I said that it should not be started, task two, of course, before 7th of October. Okay, now let's say that I want to remove that constraint and I will put here, for example, that I want that this task will be ended at Monday. So it cannot be ended before. And if I go here, I will see that nothing happened, but if my task will have duration of four days, you will see that nothing will be moved. So once again, once again, to explain this situation, I didn't have constraint for this task. I will put it now. This task should not be finished before 11th of October. And constraint is not set yet because this task uh, duration was, uh, was extended and this task wasn't su supposed to finish earlier uh, anyway. But if I put here three days or two days, then you will see that my constraint will be set because I decreased duration, but since this constraint was set and it was set to 11th of October, it says it will start at 8 and finished at 11th. So start date was moved as well. And those two types of constraint are only two types which you can set for tasks in Microsoft Project for the Web. What does it mean? It means that you don't have 
uh, and of course you have constraint which is flexible constraint uh, uh, as soon as possible and if I remove those uh, those constraint I will have as soon as possible so if there is no constraint set it is as soon as possible and those and another two uh, constraints which are available is start not earlier than and finish not earlier than you cannot set must start on or must finish on uh, uh, and start uh, because this is not a copy of Microsoft Project Desktop application, and uh, for now you cannot set those constraints. Only two constraints which can be set for tasks are start not earlier than. It means that task can start later, but not uh, uh, no uh, no not earlier than it was set, and. Uh, if you set uh, finish not earlier than, it means that task cannot be finished earlier earlier than uh, a date which was set, but it can finish later. And I hope this helps. And thank you very much. See you next time.